everybody. It's Linan. Welcome to my channel. Sorry. I'm trying out my new It Serum Lip Gloss Enjoy to the World. Oh my god. Okay. Today's video I just filmed like a bunch of hauls. Um, good lord have mercy. Somebody help me. I have been spending way too much money lately. Today's haul is going to be part one of my uh, Sephora VIB haul. Now, if you guys all know, I'm sure you all know, Sephora had the VIB haul. Uh, the 20% off, the friends and family, yada, yada, yada. The website was shut down for like an entire day. Um, I ordered stuff online. That's why I'm saying this is part one. Um, the stuff I ordered online, I actually ordered first. And I have not got that yet. So I went in store because I could not wait any longer. And I picked up some things that caught my eye. Um... Now, a lot of the holiday stuff that they came out with this year just really, I don't know, they just all look the same and like the same as last year's collection or whatever the case may be. So, I mean, I picked up several things, but not, I did not pick up a lot of holiday stuff, holiday collections, probably just two, but uh, let's get started. Uh, the first thing I picked up, this is very exciting, except for the bag is the Too Faced Under the Mistletoe uh, Limited Edition La Creme Limited Edition Lipstick Trio and Glitter Bag. This bag is the only bad thing about it. There's so much glitter when you open this bag up. I really don't want to get glitter all over myself, but it's a cute bag, but glitter will literally go everywhere. So if you have like a paper towel or something, I suggest putting that down, but I do not. So I'm going to get glitter all over the place. It's cute, but it's messy. And it's just like the Everything Nice palette. If you guys own that, I swatched it, didn't like it. I mean, look, I'm already getting glitter all over the place. Oh, this is terrible. But you open the bag up. Ugh. And the La Cremes are inside this pretty... Pretty, pretty, pretty pink tissue paper and La Creme lipsticks are my favorite. So you get three limited edition ones and they're all shimmer. So you get Shimmering Naked Dolly. I'm not going to swatch them. I will do separate videos on them. I will do separate videos of swatches on all of my new things. So that is Shimmering Naked Dolly. Then you get Shimmering Spice Spice Bye Bye, which I have like the original one of this, but this one is supposedly shimmering. I see little specks of glitter in it, but not much. The only thing that's freaking glittery is the damn bag. Get off me. And the last one you get is Shimmering Marshmallow, which I do not have this in the actual full size so I'm excited about that that's so that was blah, 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 $28 oh my god there is glitter everywhere what the that's, I do not like this bag I'm gonna get rid of this bag ASAP but I'm putting it back in the bag for now because I want to do swatches and all oh, hey, hey. <laughs> Get back in your freaking box because you got glitter all over my counter, my hands, everywhere. This, see what I mean? Do you see that glitter? Ugh. But anyway, it's a great value for $28. You get three full size lipsticks, but the bag sucks ass. I hate it. Too much glitter. The next thing I got from Too Faced is this cute little adorable in the Sephora. They have the little, you know, check out 
when you go up to the checkout and they have all the stocking stuff or gifts and all that stuff. My Sephora here, the mall, is like the biggest Sephora I have ever seen. They had this section of little like sample stocking stuff or things that went on like it was like it just went forever and there was stuff beyond stuff beyond stuff I saw this in there this was twenty five dollars but it comes with four of the Too Faced melted lipsticks and I really do not think one person can use up a full melted lipstick so I got this because to be honest I'm not going to use a full melted lipstick so I thought this was a great idea as a matter of fact, I picked up two just in case I do run out, if I do like them. I don't know how, I've never tried these before, so I don't know. Wait, did I try them? Yes, I did try them, and I remember not liking them. I don't know. Whatever, I just thought this was a great deal. $25, you get four of them. So you get Melted Berry, Melted Fuchsia, Melted Peony, and Melted Nude. I will do a separate video on swatches of these as well along with everything else. I might swatch, swatch the other stuff I got. So then I got a Kat Von D blush in Heart Graham. Love the packaging. And I need to go pick up some more of these. Did I order more of my Sephora haul online? I don't remember. Oh, son of a bleep. Look at the packaging. I hope I did not break that. I hope I didn't break it. Please tell me I did not break it. How do you open? Why can't I open this? Oh, there you go. Okay, it didn't break. So anyway, I only picked up one because I've never tried any of her blushes before and I wanted to see if I liked it or not. So this is the packaging, and this was 20 something bucks I want to say, and it's called Heart Graham. comes with a decent sized mirror, and that's what the color looks like. And let's swatch it, because I do want to swatch this. That is pretty packaging. Ooh, nice and creamy. Pretty color. I need a wipey. So I picked that up. Kat Von D blush in Heartgram. And I think I ordered more on my um, online order. I'm not sure. I'll have to go back and look. But yeah. Good deal. 25 bucks. Love it. Now the rest is all NARS. I picked up another NARS Pro Prime Smudge Proof Eyeshadow Base Primer because this shit is the bomb and it's out of the packaging because I've been using it because it does not crease your eyeshadow and I love it. At first I did not like it but now it's like my holy grail. Okay, let's get into the NARS stuff. Oh wait, oh, one more thing that's not NARS. I got the little Bite Beauty, um... High Pigment Lip Pencil Crayon Ulta Pigment um, little set here. So it comes the way of Pomegranate, Rhubarb, Sable, and Winterberry. And the case is to die for. It's like this hard case. You could reuse the case. You open it up. Comes with this mirror, huge mirror by the way, and this cute little packaging. And then these, that's a nice little case. You could put some bobby pins, whatever you want to put in there. So this is what they look like. And those are pretty decent sizes. So let's swatch them even though I'm sure everybody and their mother has already seen these. So this one is pomegranate. Ooh, that's beautiful. So there's pomegranate. Then 
the next one is, I oh got it so hard to see, this so tiny, Sable. It's like a pinky nude. Sable's right there. Then the next one you get is Winterberry. Winterberry. This set was a great deal too. I think this was 20 something bucks as well. Then the last one you get is Rhubarb and it looks like that. These lipsticks are amazing. Creamy, pigmented, beautiful. And this set was a great deal. So there's Rhubarb. I don't know. I thought it was a great deal. I like the little case actually. I think I'm going to keep them in the case. Okay. So that thing is definitely worth the money. Especially if you want to try out Bite Beauty and you have not tried it out yet. I highly recommend picking this cape, this little set up, this little holiday set because it's it's a good way to try them out. Okay, now the last couple things are all NARS. They're, I got one, two, three, four NARS things, but they were very expensive, so. Yes, I know. So, of course, I had to get this. It, this is the NARS Virtual Domination Cheek Palette, and it comes with, everybody and their mother is reviewing this right now. I will do a separate video on this. But it comes with, um, this Liberty is the highlighter, sex fantasy, blush, deep throat, final cut, and a Laguna. So everybody and their mother is reviewing this right now. I don't want to be like that, so I will wait to do a separate video on this. All these things, if you guys want to see swatches of any of this stuff, let me know in the comments and I will do that for you. Oh my god, are you serious? I can't even get this thing open. It's because of my nails, guys. My nails are... What was I doing? I have this magnetic bookshelf and I was getting a book out for my daughter and you have to like push it up for it to slide up and go, you know, close to get the books out. So as I was doing that, it fell. I just got my nails done not too long ago. It, acts, it fell and crushed my freaking tips, my acrylic tips. Now, if you have ever gotten your nails done, you know how painful that is when you slam your finger in the door or whatever the case may be. It cracked this whole hand, the tips right off of my finger. It hurt like a son of a bitch. I think I said every curse word in the book. So it comes in this cute little case. The packaging is adorable. It looks like snowflakes and stuff like that. It's just absolutely gorgeous. So there's what it looked like. A big, huge-ass mirror. So like I said, I will do a separate video on that because everybody and their mother and their grandmother and so on and so forth is doing reviews on that. So Probably everything else I'm going to show too. Then I picked up the separate limited edition blush in Elmira. Elmira? Elmira? Same packaging. I spent a lot of money that day. It seems like I didn't get that much stuff, but NARS itself is expensive. So if you just think about the NARS stuff that I got, it's just it's same packaging, except for it's black. It's got like that snowflakey looking effect. So this is called Almira, Almira. I am not sure how to pronounce it. That's what it looks like on the finger. What is on my hand? And that's what it looks like swatched. Come out, little guy. So 
So this blush is limited edition. Go pick it up. It's called Elmira, Elmira, whatever the fuck. I don't know. I don't care. I mean, I do care because it was expensive. That friggin' this alone was like $69. This was 30 And then I picked up one of the limited edition lipsticks, which was 26 And this one's in Femme Fleur. Femme Fleur. Femme Fleur. I love the packaging of this. Look, look how tiny it is. It's so cute. Femme Fleur, guys. Femme Fleur, and I'm going to pick up the other one because there's only two or three, I think, limited edition lipsticks. But they're so tiny compared to the Aud NARS Audacious lipsticks. Is that what they're called? Okay. So that's Femme Fleur. So I got three things from the limited edition collection. Then the last and final thing from my in store VIB haul is a NARS Audacious lipstick. In Anita. And I love this because it is magnetic. And I love the packaging of this. I prefer the packaging of this better though. I like this packaging. So this is Anita. We're going to swatch Anita right here. This is the most beautiful pink color, pinky nude color I have ever seen in my life. I ordered Anna, Charlotte, what was the other one? Uh, I ordered two more. I don't know the names. I forgot. I have to look. But yeah, guys, that is my Sephora haul, VIB haul, in-store purchase. Part one, waiting on my online order to come. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching and have a wonderful day.